Begin audio prompt in three, two. Oh shit! Did I catch you off guard? Yeah, you did. What's going on, everybody? My name is Steel Navig, and welcome to Freddy Frazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. So let's get down into this. I have not tried this game yet, and I'm scared. So I don't know what's going on. Yeah. Just a heads up, everybody. The next couple of minutes, we'll be showing the intro of the video, and if you don't want to watch that, you can skip to this time card now. Well, back to the video. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as Atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus Revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and Safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled Finished in Blueprint Mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Okay, so... Oh, jeez. Okay, so I just went through the, like, the little first things first, like the intro here. So I gotta buy some stuff and I gotta put it in my area. So let's buy this. Take one. Sold out. You sold... You either already had this on this item or an under upgrade version. Buy. 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 I don't have enough money. I'm broke already. <laughs> oh, bad. Okay, dumpster driver weekly. Okay, so let's see what's here. And we got this thing here. Let's put this. Uh, let's put some stuff. Oh, yeah. Booyah. We got some tableware. So, finished? Yeah. Good. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, 
and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, onto other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. Now get to it. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day, and you can go get some coffee. Uh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I'm not good with horror. You guys, see, if you guys see my slender stuff, I'm not good at horror. And who, who little kid draws like that? Clean ovens. Motion. That's just me. Audio. Vent. Silent ventilation is a secondary ventilation system that runs in the background, creating a minimum noise. Activation silent ventilation. Active motion scanner. Activate. Yes. Uh, okay. Order supplies. Order in cups. I'm not good at scaring. I don't, I'm not good at this. And I'm like really kind of waking out already. And I don't, mm-hmm. Turn that off. Order in cups. Oh, I gotta keep it there. Come on, go to the other side. What's the heck? What the heck? Stay there. More plates. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Order napkins. Order napkins. Order napkins. My hands are sweating. Knees weak. Arms are heavy. Mom's spaghetti. I'm not liking this at all. Come on! Scan faster! Who gets these kind of jobs? Who get? Who would want to be in this kind of work environment? This place sucks. You're in a ventilation system. I would not work here at all. Never. Not once. Not one bit. Oh god! Come on! Print faster! Print faster! Why is it blinking? Nothing in audio. Huh. Well, I thought I saw I saw something in the screen. I thought it was just a reflection from the screen. It scared the crap out of me. Oh my God, I'm like shaking. I don't I don't I don't I don't do good in horror. I don't do well in scary situations. Like normal life, I'm fine. Except in this kind of situation, I'm not good at. Like a disaster. I don't I don't know why I'm just not good at this. And, and I don't I don't like it at all and I'm just kind of not working with it and I'm, I'm scared there's gonna be a jump scare because I know I'm not gonna do well and it's not printing it's not printing I gotta start printing again I don't know why I keep switching it and uh, uh, I don't I don't like this at all and 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 I I, I, I don't I'm stuttering because I'm thinking while I'm trying to talk and it's not good clean ovens come on come on come on come on come on come on Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on the hell on, come on, come on, come on. Replace bulb. Come on, yeah, 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 yeah. Is there even anything activated in this match?
Good, good, good. Oh, I got to turn my vent on. I have fifteen dollars. Log off. Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. I don't think I can do this. I don't think I can do this. Oh, God. I'm Congratulations on completing your first day. However, your job isn't over just yet. There is another aspect to your end of day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death, should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origin. I can't move this paper. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. <sighs> I'm throwing it in the alley. I don't care. I'm throwing it in the alley. I'm. Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. No new lawsuits. That's good. Oh my god. What can I buy? Oh, we need sanitation. Discount cooling unit. Very good. Yeah. Stan's budget tech. Uh. Let's see here. Let's, yeah. Printer mode. His, my, my mouth's really dry. Is anyone else's mouth really dry? Like, I... I'm not liking this at all. There's a cool vent. Nice vent. Okay, let's go. Let's go over here. Ugh. And, and. Okay, so it's. Let's go buy a platform. There we go. Double stage. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. That works too. Print. Okay. Nothing there. So I just bought a single stage for nothing. That's great. That's cool. I just I shit in offers. Uh, Marty's Plunger. Nothing goes down that can't come up. Uh, Marty's Plunger LLC is offering a new pay for advertisement in establishment. It's 500 bucks or do I accept it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I get 500 bucks. Yeah. Dude. Yeah. Plunge away. Okay. Uh, finished. I'm like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, not, not scared, but I'm scared. I don't. <sighs> Come on, order the freaking cups. Come in. Uh, let's get that printer. Ooh, oh boy, it's prints it prints way softer now. Nobody's here. Scanning. Come on, scan. Scan a little faster. I 
I played like the regular Fazbear one where you uh, like you're in the office and you gotta open the doors and stuff. I played that when I was in high school. Everyone said, "Oh, it's a fun game. It's a fun game." I tried it out. So that's why they're there. <laughs> Oh, my hands are like not feeling good. How do people like horror games? I don't get how people can like horror games. It's not fun at all for me. Like, what is with these bears? This stuff. Move straight there on on automatically. I don't know why. It's scared. It's scary. Come on, finish printing. Hire handyman. I need to, I need to buy some stuff. Maintenance. Okay. Unclog toilets. Unclog toilets. Let's go. Why am I in a ventilation system? Why am I in a ventilation system? This has nothing to do with any sort of requirements. Why are we even... Why is there vents? Like, because I should get, like, an office or something. I have an office. Like, but no. We can't just get be a normal person and have an office. Because, oh, God forbid we have an office. Be normal employees without these killer freaking bears everywhere. Like, who in the right mind has a kid that draws a clown? Who who doesn't have a kid that does... Who has a kid that like clowns? I don't have anyone that know. Yes. Uh, log off. Log the hell off. Oh, my God. Closing time. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Uh, my back, my back itches. My Before back itches. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Uh, throw it in the alley. Salvage a thousand dollars? No. I'm not doing that. No. Don't forget Saturday. You want them all to be in one place. We're not keeping salvage. I don't care. We're not doing that. I'd rather go bankrupt instead of having to see a freaking I feel like I'm playing this game smart instead of playing in it for entertainment. That's what I feel like I'm doing. Cause I don't want to be scared. And I don't like being scared, but people like it when I'm scared because I've got several comments before when I was playing Slender saying uh, Not in the comment section, but told in person that saying hey guess what? I loved it when you were scaring and pissing your pants because you were so Entertained by the Slender Man coming straight at your face because you know what everyone loves that or the little girl that came up running like a little marathon girl like uh, Like a bolt from the Olympics and you know what whatever it's fine. There's a lot of fun stuff here. Too bad I won't enjoy it. Sponsor offership. Sponsorship offer. Yeah, a thousand bucks. That's the same as much as the salvage. Yes. Except. Oh, I got some moolah now. I can buy some more stuff at the. I don't need to buy this kind of things. So let's go to Sans Tech. Uh. Let's let's. Okay, let's. No, unavailable. Unavailable. Good. I don't want that freaking thing. Oh, because it's. I have enough money for it. If I start buying these things, liability risk. Warning, purchasing a bulky item in this condition comes with a significant risk of something undesirable hiding inside. No. No, 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 no. Entertainment. Yeah, let's buy these. Entertainment wallet? No, let's get some. Ooh, yes, we want these kind of things. Yeah. Cool. Oh yeah, we got some more reputation. What can go there? You know what? We got stuff right now. Let's finish. Ooh, okay, cool, 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 cool. I can upgrade the room. Oh, I can upgrade the room. I should upgrade the room. Ordering supplies. Order cups. Come on. Come on. Come on. Motion detector. Scanning. Wait, do I even have any electro- Wait, am I being scared for nothing? Because I have no electronics in this room. 
There's nothing here because I don't buy nothing. Print flyers. So am I just being overprotective for nothing? Because I had nothing going on. I didn't buy any single machine. I don't have. I'm not salvaging anything because I'm not. I ain't doing that. That's that's just a dumb way to live life. Like, the people in, like, in horror movies, I always hate them so much. Because they're like, oh, you know what? Let's go in this room. No, Billy. Let's not go in the room, okay? Because there's... Why? Why, Grandma? Well, Billy, there's a freaking monster in the heading that's in the house. And we don't know what's in that room because it's locked. But, Grandma... No, Billy. What does Billy do, though? He finds a key, opens the basement, and guess what? Havoc all over the house. And then the city dies, and then the world dies, and then he starts going up to the moon and starts killing the aliens up there, because that's what the monster in the basement does, Billy. Ugh, dumb Billy. So, I feel like I'm in worry about nothing, because there's nothing here. Let's just keep doing my job. Who cares about entertaining the kids? I don't care about entertaining the kids. I don't care. That's fine. Oh, I, I guess I do. I'm doing it right now on YouTube. Probably not entertaining anybody because they're not watching me scared, but... I don't... I know there's nothing there, but why am I still, like, shivering? I'm, like, <laughs> still shivering because I know that I don't like it. And that's the... That's the beauty of it. I, I can't do this. I, I'm going to have an aneurysm one day. I'm going to be I'm gonna be like, no! No, nope, it's going to happen. This is gonna happen. Okay, we got everything done, so let's just let that go off. Closing time. Awesome. I'm not. <sighs> that was that was still hard. I don't know why. <laughs> Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage, or if you choose to. You can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Uh. Fuck it. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state. I don't know how to get out of this. It's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic. I can't get out. Increase its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two... <laughs> OH SHIT! Did I catch you off guard? Yeah, you did! You did! Something's loose in the pizzeria. Oh my god! Fuck this game. <laughs> uh -huh. You think I'm exaggerating? No, I'm not. I really don't like this at all. Sponsorship offer. Go for it. I don't care anymore. Let's just buy some sponsorships. Upgrade. Oh, it looks so much better now. Oh, nice. Oh, look at this place. Oh, there's a bunch of toothpaste. Wacky wart. <laughs> Wacky wart paste. That's not toothpaste. <laughs> okay, wow. This place is. This place is going great. Play tokens left. What do you mean play tokens? Uh, clean and polish. Add coin slot. Clean and polish. Yeah, let's clean and polish. There we go. Uh, add coin slot. Clean and polish. Safety straps. Uh, risk. Safety straps. There we go. Uh, risk is zero. Clean polish. There's no risk. Add to coin slots. So let's let's look here. Fan's fine. Okay, let's go back to catalog. <sighs> Honestly, I really wish I did not see that bear. Okay, so buy item. Sanitation station. Uh, buy. Yeah, let's buy this. Is we need to make sure we're healthy and safe. Bucket Bob. Bucket Bob. Yes, we need him. I need Bucket Bob. I need Bucket Bob in my life. Because without Bucket Bob, what what is really this place? He's going to go up here. Bucket Bob. Oh, yeah. I love Bucket Bob. We're, we're going to put all our money into Bucket Bob. I guess not. Ah, oh, man. I love Bucket Bob. He's cool. 
Oh, this is clean spot. I don't even know what Bucket Bob does, but I love Bucket Bob. Look at him! He's so happy! Oh, okay, let's... Let's just... One more round. One more round. Uh, now I'm scared, because I know someone's here. Order the goddamn cups. Let's go. Someone's in the pizzeria. Huh? Order plates, order plates, order plates. Order the plates, order the plates, order the plates. God, okay, come on. We're all good. We're all good. He's right there. He's right there. He's right there. Uh, turn this vent. Come on. We're fine. It's not fun. This game's not fun at all. My throat hurts. So, if you enjoyed the game, please like. Or don't, you know one's enjoy this game. Just like the video, please, because I can't do it this no more. I'll probably play this again if this, people like this video, but right now I don't want to play it. I don't want to play this more. So, <laughs> I don't like this at all. If if you like the video, give it a like. I don't I don't like the game, so but if you like it and you like to see me cry, just give it, let me know in the comments and I'll I'll play games similar to this, I guess. I, I just I need to go for a walk. <laughs> anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And please have a no no stress or scaring day. Just have a great day. Bye guys.